What's good, YouTube? I'm Sir Hall, and welcome back to my channel, where the voice is deep and the shoes are cheap. Today we have a special package in from a seller called Kick Who. Um, as you can tell, we got a white box today with the elephant print on the bottom. So that can only mean one thing. We got a Jordan 4 in the house. So, first look at the box, I'm seeing the new 21, 2021 flight with the Joe Man logo. Air Jordan 4 Retro, white, tech gray, black, fire red. Size 10 and a half. You know my size. Now you can send me whatever you want. All right, let's get into this shoe. So I'll have the seller info on the screen. Kiku is a very cool seller. Um, this is my first time purchasing from them. I had no problem choosing my size, color, communication. Came double boxed, uh, came shipped within a week and have nothing negative to say. Quality is incredible as you'll see in a few minutes. All right, let's get these shoes on the table. All right, so these are a very crispy shoe. Um, that white can literally blind you, it's glistening. Very nice Miami Cocania style shoe. This is reminding me of a Tony Montana Al Pacino style shoe, if you know what I mean. So getting into the shoe, uh, the leather looks incredible, it looks retail. The paint looks very good, no cage flaw. Cages are extremely clean. Um, laces look good, stitching is impeccable. Not a flaw in sight. The tongues look clean too. This cracked leather is incredible. Like this is what makes Jordan brand what it is. Excellent. So now let's get into the front of the shoe. You can see the leather here on the toe box. Stitching looks good, stars look good. Again, like I said, the cage is clean. Laces look good all the way up and both tongues are perfect. Jumpman does not look pregnant or too skinny. Top stitching of the tongue is clean. Getting into the left shoe, same thing. Nothing wrong with this shoe. Honestly, if I walked into a store and saw this shoe, I wouldn't think twice. Very clean colorway. And slightly different from the white cement drop. So this is the white Oreo. So subtle differences that you can compare both of those. But I, I honestly, I think I prefer these more. Also a quick, quick little Easter egg. Um, if you know your Jordans, this is a Jordan 3 tongue. So you'll see that in comparison to uh, normal Jordan 4 tongues. So they snuck that in there and it actually goes very well. And I think they should make more of these with the Jordan 3 tongue. Now looking at the back, we got the gray Jumpman. Stitching is good, boxes look good. Everything is lining up here clean and now that it's like a shiny silver on the inside of the tongue with the air jordan and i'll lift these up for you got the jumpman logo inside and jumpman logo here as well now i'll take a look at the inside of the shoe cages are good even on this pair as well, on this sneaker. It looks good to me. And I really like this black speckle paint on the gray. Very nice contrast with the white. And on the bottom, on the soles, we have the red Jumpman. Stars, crystal clean. Beautiful shoe. I wouldn't think twice about buying these from Kiku. Uh, great customer service. Like I said, they came within a week, week and a half. Um, they sent high quality QC picks and they're always working. Uh, one thing I really like about Kiku is I've been following his Instagram now and he posts a lot of daily factory videos and the how to and the process of making the shoes from scratch. So that's honestly very interesting to watch and to see how they 
make the shoes, how they compare the different materials and um, get it as close to looking identical as possible and as clean as possible to regular pairs. So honestly, these end up coming out better because they put in more work than uh, these uh, regular factories do, you know? So definitely bank on Kiku, you'll get a good pair. Uh, make sure you mention me, Enzo, for your discount. And thank you again for watching. Uh, feel free to follow me on Instagram at Enzozai, E-N-Z-O-A-Z-A-I, and on TikTok at Buzz Light Your Reps. Um, feel free to comment any shoe you'd like to see me review next. And thank you again, and have a good day.